Thank you for joining this quick how-to screencast brought to you by Salesforce Support. To see more content like this, hit subscribe. In this video, we are going to learn how to import attachments in your org via Data Loader. This is the fastest method to mass insert attachments in an org for an org migration or just simply adding files to a single record. You will need to prepare a CSV file with three columns mapping the values for each row you wish to insert. First, create a CSV with the following columns with the required fields. Parent ID. Populate this column with the ID of the record that you want to relate the attachment to. For simplicity, I'll relate all of these to the same account. If you have several accounts, you may need to export a list of record IDs that match the account to the attachments based on your own criteria. Name. Name of the attachment file, such as myattachment.jpg. Body. This is the absolute path to the attachment on your local drive. Make sure that the values in the body column contain the full path of the attachments on your computer. For an example, if an attachment is named image.jpg, then the full path on the PC would be C colon backward slash notes backward slash image dot jpeg. Since I am on a Mac, the file in my example is listed as forward slash users forward slash image dot jpeg. In this screencast, I have three attachments to insert and the information is all filled out in the CSV. Save the file. Open Data Loader. Click Insert. Enter Credentials. Click Login. And click Next. Check the box next to Show All Salesforce Objects. Select Attachment from the list of available objects. Click Browse. And select the CSV created previously. Click Next. When the Data Selection Intilization dialog appears, confirm the number of records is correct and click on OK. Click Create or Edit a Map and the Mapping dialog box will appear. Click Auto Match Fields to Columns. The column name should match up if entered correctly. If not, then drag the fields down to the column mapping. Click OK once done and click Next. Let's check if the attachments are related to the account. Log into the org, go to the account, scroll to the notes and attachments related list, and notice the three attachments have been inserted and associated to this record. Please keep in mind that in order to follow these steps, you will need system administration permissions. If you are interested in inserting attachments via Data Loader, please contact your system administrator for assistance. For more information, check out help.salesforce.com or join us on the trail at trailblazer.salesforce.com.